and we're back and this is round two on our wireless earbuds tournament these are the x3t's going against the samsung icon x for 2018. let's get this started the x3t's has come with a touch form factor on the case itself you have the touch to turn it on. You have the X3T's touch capacitive. You gotta have, you have to hold down to turn it on. If you wanna hang up on a phone call, you tap it. Touch capacitive earbuds. But I'll tell you this, they work. You got soft ear tips, but it's your, this is a standard type of ear tips that a lot of Bluetooth use. This circular design, same design from the X2Ts, the X3Ts has kept everything the same except changing to a touch form factor on the earbud itself and on the charging case. The fit on the X3Ts fit in your ear really good as you first put it in and you really feel that the seal would just be just enough to keep these in your ear. But as you walking around you get hot you might be talking, you might be eating. As time wears on, they get kind of loose and you have to readjust it. You definitely can't work out with these. So if you're only gonna use it for short periods of time, you'll probably be happy with the way these fit. The Icon X of last year was not good at all. The battery life was the biggest downfall on the Icon X. These Icon X, of 2018 really stepped it up they really solved the battery life issue now these icon x are a little bit bigger which honestly really makes it fit better in the air and it also has a seal and there's nothing special about this air tip as well it might be a little bit more softer than the x2t's but it's still a standard type of air tip now this fin right here fits pretty much in the cartilage of your ear and it really adds to the fit and the seat. These fit in your ear very good. A matter of fact, these are more for working out than the previous Icon X and the design. And it's touch capacitive. What I find with the touch capacitive on the Icon X, you're gonna make numerous mistakes on these, but they do work. So the Icon X, the build, the styling is definitely better than the X3Ts. The Icon X fits in the charging case with ease and you never have to worry they're charging. No problems at all. With the X3Ts, pretty much same type of experience. They go right in and they charge. You put on this cover and you're done. Tap twice on the case and they're charging. Now, if you're anytime you're looking at a charging case, not only you're looking at how the Bluetooth earbuds fit, you're seeing how many times you can get a charge. On the X3Ts, they're touting, you can get about three charges out of this. And on Samsung, you can definitely get two charges, two five hour charges. And with the X3Ts, you're gonna get about three five hour charges. Not bad. And they're providing at least five hours of battery life each, give or take. So let's get into the sound test of the X3Ts. Why did we take it this far? Why did we take it this far? I heard you said we're not meant to be. 
These earbuds are the truth. I'm really impressed by the X3T sound. So let's get into the sound test of the 2018 Icon X. These 2018 Icon X are the truth. I'm really impressed with the sound that you're getting. So we heard the sound test and both of these earbuds sound really good. The Samsung Icon X have a really clean sound with good strong bass, mids and highs. Really clean sound. But the X3Ts is really more dominated by bass and volume. Good mids and good highs, but I wouldn't say it's as clean as the Samsung. So if you're more of an audiophile, you'll probably lean more towards the Samsung. If you're more of a bass head, you're gonna lean more towards the X3Ts. And the X3Ts have more volume. So which one has the better sound? I think I might have to go with the Icon X when it comes to the sound. So as close as it is, I'm picking the Icon X. The issue of the X2Ts was that both earbuds tend to lose connection every now and again, and that caused uh, some disruption where people wasn't 100% satisfied with their purchase. But for the prices that the X2Ts went for, you really didn't worry about that too much because you're getting a bargain, especially for what the X2Ts deliver. The X3Ts have that same problem, maybe to a little bit of a lesser extent, but the problem is still there. Each Bluetooth, they tend to lose connection with each other every once in a while. Now, they tend to regain themselves pretty quickly, but it still happens. And there is some latency issues. With the Icon X, good Bluetooth connection to the phone. But once in a while, the Icon X do lose its connection to the phone. They don't lose their connection with each other, but they lose the connection with the phone. And that might be a little bit more aggravating than each earbud losing connection to each other. So both of these earbuds have good connections, but they have a little bit of a hiccup every now and again. With the connection, I'll give it to the Icon X because it happens a little less often than the X3Ts. Core quality on the X3Ts is really not that good. The person sometimes can't hear you, you have to talk loud or you have to be in a quiet environment. Once you have background noise, the call is absolutely shot. It's not great for call quality, but it's passable. And it's not stereo because the, the Icon X you have both earbuds you're hearing the conversation through and that leads towards a very good experience. With call quality, we gotta give it to the Icon X. Having type C is a plus in a lot of people's eyes. So overall, Samsung has done a really good improvement with the Samsung Icon X of 2018. And I gotta say, you guys know from watching this video, who is the true winner? If we're judging it, even if we added in price, which I'm not going with price. But if you want a better earbud, even if you have to pay more, it's the Samsung Icon X. So in this battle, you guys can tell, the winner is the Samsung Icon X. So the Samsung Icon X is the winner in this battle of round two. So I urge you guys, like and subscribe and leave in the comment section if you wanna see 
any true wireless earbuds in this tournament because we're not over yet so pretty much with that guys this is the end of that and we'll see you in the next one